We're now working on like the ninth project of the day today. Making a little front porch for Mamacita, our Gato Senorita. Okay, where our key door goes in and out, Mike's gonna attach a better platform, a better and a landing. Closet for it. A closet? Yeah, there's still metal gonna go up like this and over like that. Okay, cool. Because it protect because this will throw a ton of water in that area. Yeah. So the whole purpose of what we're doing is for this, in order to have that door, we can't have water coming off this tire under that door. Exactly. It's so it's disaster. protecting, yeah, it's protecting our house from getting stuff in it, but it's making a protected little place for Mama Kitty too. Luckily, we used aluminum rivets here, and these things come off super easy. Oh, okay. There it goes. Temporary one we did. This seems silly. But this actually works. Cutting a piece of metal with a razor knife? Yeah. It does seem silly. <laughs> but. And you'll hear it cracking if it worked. break to do it with but it really helps yeah since we already had it obviously it was easier to use it yeah okay so now I'm gonna do one bend yeah that'll be fine okay bend right there and that's gonna tuck up under here for screws okay. perfect and then it needs to come up 11 and a half inches. Okay. And then it has to come back this amount. And then that will be bent. Attach. Attach, yeah. Yeah, very cool. Good design. Okay. Right, we pull that thing down? Mm-hmm. Okay. This will be like this here, and then there'll be a piece of foot in here attached to this, of course. Oh, there's going to be another side? Mm-hmm. 
Ah. This is, it'll be on that side actually. Gotcha. So we build it first and then take it over there and attach it? Yes. How do we attach this edge? There's gonna, I'm gonna take some more metal and I'm going to make an L bracket right there. Mm. And it's gonna attach to the bottom of this and rivet on the bottom there. Right it's cool. A little covered kitty porch. this in flex seal or something like that. It will be really, really, really strong. Or, I'm sorry, really, really, really waterproof, which is more what I'm after here. Yeah. Alright. So, now we create a little box for her. Hmm, she kitty can porch. jump up into you like that. This is really nice. I like how it's turning out. Yeah, I think it'll work. I think it'll be great. Maybe we should go fit it and see if it actually, if I did a good job or not. Uh, right? Well, well, that'll work. Never mind. <laughs> <We're over. laughs> suck is about to start though. <laughs> Putting all this on? Yeah, because I have to drill these holes. Oh, you have to pre-drill them? Mm -hmm. I guess that's the only In way here. rivets work. Duh. Yeah. So, ideally I just need to drill like one, two, three, four of them so I can post it. Get it in place? Yeah, and then it won't be so bad. Okay. Oh, do we have any, uh, this would be that time for the, uh... The what? Doodle tape. Oh. Okay, let me start the search. Super finder, she's gonna find the butyl tape, oh yeah. Let's see, there used to be... You know, some... I would look in the bus under, in the, in, in the, the box. electrical. Super finder, she found the butyl tape, yeah. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna not be able to tape the bottom simply because if any water does get in there, I'd like it to leak out. Okay, gotcha. Not be like a permanent fixture. Wow, did you just see that? Yes. Man. That's the easiest I've ever seen the peel come off the butyl tape. Yeah, that's amazing. What in the world? Oh, going for two. Ah! Oh, almost. Almost, almost. A tour. People are like, what are they talking about? I know, right? <laughs> Usually all the butyl tape tears to bits like this last little thing. Yeah, I feel like that first one was a miracle shot. Yeah. Okay. Unprecedented. Unprecedented. Never be spore seen during the Bussy McBuss face build. Or in the history of butyl tape in general. <laughs> okay, we're going to do it again. 
Uh, you get to hold this up again while I get it, once I get it in position here. Okay. Oh, yeah. I can put on rivets with one eye closed. Wait, with just one eye, period. Well, she's coming to check progress. Wanna see how it's going over here? I think I just punched through the inside. Whoops. Oh, man, I did. Oh, well. Is that uh, through the metal or through the wood? Through the wood. <laughs> Here's what it looks like from in here, you guys. Mama Kitty's little entrance to her own little door in and out. There's some major kitty house construction going on under here. Well, as much of a pain as it is, it's going to be really cool when it's done. That's true. <sighs> one handed, rough beast. All right, those are those. Now I gotta get this one to the bottom. There's a little. We had a little uh oh. What? Huh? I'm just talking to the camera. Hello, camera. I'm gonna glue that back. There, I glued it down and taped it. Better hurry up, this dry. cat's about to kill me. Mama Kitty, you wanna see your front porch? Yes, we made it for you. Oh, look right here, Mama. She's like, come out. She just left. Wow, that's cool, man. It is very cool. Little kitty porch extraordinaire. That's as good as it gets for a bus cat. Mama Kitty! What are you doing? You could come in your door, you know. Don't you want to come in? You just like it on your little kitty porch? She's just chilling in her little kitty porch with no intentions of coming in. Do you like your new spot, Mama Kitty? Well, I think the kitty porch has got the seal of approval from Mama Sita. This just settles it. She's just happy, perfectly happy to just hang out and chill right there. <laughs>